This video is brought to you by Private Internet Access. Now I could be sitting here worried about somebody finding out that I spent the last 15 hours of my life shopping for blenders on the internet, but I don't have to. Thanks to the secure no log privacy I get from Private Internet Access's VPN service, nobody knows that I have an unsatiable urge to watch fruit spin until it is liquid. Private Internet Access is easy to use. With over 20k servers in 70 plus countries, geo-locked content is available with a simple click. 30 million users can't be wrong, so try it today with a 30 day money back guarantee. And you too can have that peace of mind when you go to privateinternetaccess.com slash doormonster and help yourself to three years of internet and data protection for just 208 a month. And heck, just from me, I'll give you two more months free because I just like you that much. So go on to privateinternetaccess.com slash doormonster to get the peace of mind you deserve on a VPN. And hey, special price offer just for you, only you. I love you. <gasps> Dang it, they've already taken the pharmacy. I thought you said these guys were unranked. They are, I swear. Maybe they're good at some other game. Pre-existing skill? That's basically cheating. Oh, oh. Okay, but on the other hand, it's never too late to start building some, right? Okay, right. I've got a plan, but it's gonna take some luck. How many flashbangs? Hey, hey, are you even listening? Yeah, I'm listening, but uh, what's that? That, that's just the campaign mode. Ignore it and listen to my brilliant strategy, okay? Like I was saying just a moment ago. Well, we should play it, right? Yeah, no. All that is, is the boring version of the good stuff. This good stuff. Why would I pay $70 for that when they've been so kind as to leave this online multiplayer around for free? Right, right. Yeah, that makes sense. Thank you. All right, so you still have a few rockets left, right? I know you dropped the launcher, but that's okay. We won't need it. All I need you to do is take the leftovers. Maybe that's why we're bad. The campaign's what you play to like brush up on all your skills. Get the lay of the land. All that jazz. Oh my God, we do not have time for this. Do you see this? Do you see my virtual blood? Oh wow, this generation really has fluid mechanics down to a science. It's on your hands! My blood is on your hands! I need you here, focused, right now, okay? Okay, right, sorry, I'm with you. Yeah, darn right you are. If we had been able to take advantage of my frankly staggering tactical IQ, we'd been in better position, but I think we're still in this. Okay, so they have scattered, probably to the hospital into the, uh, well, whatever that building is in the east. You'd know the call out's better if you played the stupid campaign. Look, I have a $200 a week streaming deal on my buddy's channel if I can grind my way up through Petty Aluminum Major by the end of the month. But to do that, I need you to, at the very least, be a warm body that fires bullets in the vague direction of the enemy. However, if you cannot do that, because you are so enchanted by the half-baked afterthought that is an FPS campaign, I swear to Bungie, I will exit to settings right now and turn on friendly fire. Got it? Fine, got it. All right, so for the last time, the plan is, oh my God. You know, you should really listen to your friend there. The developers put a lot of effort into this. A lot of programmers, writers, and artists lost sleep over this. So really, you should give them more credit. Daisy, Daisy, this is what I mean. I need help, help. What do you even think you're gonna get out of this? I don't know, I like having motivation for doing stuff. I like stories. Right now it's like, kill them! But like, why? Why kill them? Because they're bad! How do you not get that? But what kind of bad are they? Are they trying to conduct horrendous unethical scientific experiments? Are they hellbent on imperialist expansionism? Are we a part of a fractured whole, sibling versus sibling, that will end in only tragedy? I owe several thousand dollars worth of back taxes, but what's a little tax evasion these days? That's not evil, it's just unethical. They are bad because they are shooting at us. That should be enough. Yeah, we do do that, don't we? And stories? What stories? Here, let me just give you a little situation. You're in a war-torn, crumbling ruin of a city, and you gotta fight your way across it to get to an extraction point. What game's campaign are you playing? Final Fighter Fighting Five, Level Three, Siege of Barovia. Great stage, bro. It's not about the originality of it. 
It's still a frame to put the action in, and I like that. But you'd still be doing the same missions. Spoiler alert, all of these maps, they're from game stages. You'd be doing literally the same thing, just with stupider AI versions of us. That's part of it, okay? Like you're good at all this online stuff, but I'm just not. I want to be able to play without real people looking at me and thinking I'm dumb. You know what, dude? I'm happy for you. I say follow your dreams, go for it. Yeah, okay, obviously don't listen to him. He's got ulterior motives. Hey, thanks, guy. I think I will. Really? You're gonna leave me alone with these two? Me? The very best partner that you've ever had? Yep, bye. Just awesome. Thanks, guys. No problem, buddy. Damn it, they've already taken the pharmacy. Perfect. Ta-da. We'd like to give the hugest shout out in the entire world to Team Combat here in San Antonio. They were a laser tag place. They were outrageously accommodating to us, uh, super helpful. If you are ever in the area, if you ever liked shooting anything, real guns, fake guns, video game guns, laser tag guns, airsoft guns, come check it out. They've got the coolest place in the entire world. Uh, tell us about it. Hey, my name's Aaron. This is my wife, Sarah. We're the owners here at Team Combat San Antonio. Uh, we provide tactical laser tag, so we are geared more towards the adult and teen audiences. We have a 7,000 square foot battlefield built up like a small town, uh, interactive sound and lights, and all our equipment is military grade. So the weapon itself looks like a, looks, feels like a real weapon. Uh, we offer 10 different game modes, very similar to some of your uh, FPS games like uh, Call of Duty. So we see Siege, Search and Destroy, we have VIP Escort, Domination, a bunch of different games, Team Deathmatch. Uh, so come on out, uh, give us a try. We are great for team building and parties and uh, walk-in play. Definitely check them out and thank you again so much.